Oh, hello. Yes, am I through to the um, Jehovah's Witnesses? I'm on JW.org website. Yes, you are, yes. Oh, hi there. The number's given as the congregation for Milton Keynes uh, South. Hi. That's right, yeah. Uh, great. Um, I'm reading your book, Enjoy Life Forever. Um, if you're at work and it's you're busy at the moment, I, I can always speak some other time, of course. No, 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 it's fine. Perfect timing, actually. Okay. Um, there's quite a lot in the book, um, some of which I know already and some of which is a little bit new to me. Right. Um, chapter 8 is very interesting. You can be Jehovah's friend. Right, yeah. Um, the introduction says, Jehovah wants you to know him better. Why? He hopes that the more you will, you learn about his personality, his ways and his purpose, the more you will want to be his friend. Can you really be God's friend? What can you do to become his friend? The Bible answers those questions and reveals why friendship with Jehovah is the most important relationship you can have. The book seems to imply that you can become a friend of Jehovah today, but I don't see that as possible. Um, well, I, I think what he's saying is it, it's over a period of time. I mean, like, like um, if we were to meet up, the first thing we would do is exchange names and then over a period of time we would you know go for a walk and then we talk about things and we would get to know uh, over a period of time now initially mm -hmm. we would be an acquaintance um, but over a period of yes. time that would develop into a friendship so what it's saying is the start of that is getting to know jehovah's name and then over a period of time, you get to know about his qualities. Um, when you when you read the Bible and you see his experiences and how he dealt with humans, you begin to see him not just as a as a force for good, but actually as a personality. Mm -hmm. So it, 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 it's a it's a constant process as we get to know him better. But yes, yeah. the, the starting point is is getting to know his name and what that means. Um, I don't believe anyone can become a friend of God today. I believe God only has sons and sons, sons, sons of God, that's men and women, or children of God by adoption. Um, yeah. That's Romans eight, fourteen to seventeen. I don't believe that friends of God exist today. I don't believe we read anywhere in the Book of Acts of, you know, Bill came to faith in Jehovah and he was a friend of God. We don't read anywhere in Galatians or Ephesians about anybody coming to faith as a friend of God. People who come to faith, come to faith as sons of God by adoption in the new covenant, children of God, not as friends of God. The term friend of God, as I understand it, was used of Old Testament saints like Abraham, who died in their sins mm -hmm. right before Christ, um, mm -hmm. but trusting in the Messiah who was to come. So after Christ's death, burial and resurrection, the friends of God became sons of God by adoption. And there are no more friends of God after Christ's resurrection. That's the way that I would see it. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I, I take your point. Um, we obviously feel differently. We feel that we can get to know God to a point of being of being a friend. But that's that's an ongoing process. That that's a constant process. But of course, you know, just as um, we can lose a friend um, physically, we yes. can lose our friendship with God if we uh, if we displease Him or or do things that are go against His will. Um, where in the New Testament does it say that people can come to faith as a friend of God? Uh, I will need to have a look at that. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm sure there are expressions that, uh, that, that, that do link to that, but yes. Um, I haven't found any. I, I have been looking for quite some time. Um, the reference to Abraham in James 2.23 doesn't really apply because that's a past tense. He was a friend oh, of God. Heard. Past tense. So, you know, after Christ's death, burial and resurrection, um, I, I mean, if I'm wrong, show me from the Bible where... Sure. Where my yeah. understanding okay. is, is 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 wrong. Okay, um, you've got my my name is Robert. You've got my number. Yeah. Um, that that's one of the things. Um, I was a bit puzzled at chapter fifteen. Who is Jesus? Yeah. 